never been to Switzerland, but I'm so happy I made it, finally. Right. We are currently in Sugar Creek, Ohio. This is known as Little Switzerland. Uh, yeah. yeah. You'd yeah. say so, Murph? I've never been there, but this is why I would expect a lot of yodeling and cuckoo clocks and, <laughs> you know, tapestries outside the buildings. Also, free uh, coupons for uh, a third Jeez. pound of cheese. So Hold on, should we? Should we show them? Yeah, go ahead, show them. I actually have show the people of how much dairy we're going to eat. You never pass today. up on free cheese. Free cheese. Free cheese. There we go. Half pound, too. Half. No, third pound. Third, third pound. pound. Let's not get crazy. That's not like half it's, pound. It's, That's it's, how they lose it's, businesses. It's damn Switzerland, it. not Canada. It's fine. <laughs> so, the story behind here uh, we're actually like right next to Holmes County in Ohio. So, basically, Holmes County has actually the highest concentrated amount of Amish in like the US. So this is actually one of the areas, it's like here in Millersburg are both like heavily Amish. Um, but the reason why there's so much Swiss here is that apparently uh, Swiss people came over as well with the Amish when they immigrated to the U.S. and they kind of settled in this area. So uh, it's home to one of the biggest cuckoo clocks, I guess, in the nation. Pretty much created, not created, he painted all the facades on these buildings of Swiss. Oh, did he? His trips to Switzerland. They said he was technically self taught. He was never officially. Yeah, it's right here. That's how you can tell that you got Mennonites in Mennonite Church. I like how it says on a 1958 AD. <laughs> I think it's the first time I've seen a building marked AD. Just in case you forgot, man. Right? right? <laughs> There's a few buggies that we've seen driving in and there's a couple like horse stalls or stables that are kind of just situated around this town. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I don't oh, oh, you're fine, don't worry. I've seen that woman five times a day. So this is kind of like a culmination of the history of the area, uh, Amish history, um, kind of how they've lived everyday, everyday life, you know, the usual. But yeah, as you guys can see, this is pretty substantial. Look at that. Nice. Simple. This is pretty, pretty this is neat. Sort of like bread, like maybe have motorized like bakery. Like German, bread. step up your game. Have a motorized bakery. I'm sure they did. Ideas. <laughs> Nike's big back then. Ironic. <laughs> <laughs> How much you want to bet she haunts this place at night? Murph, you want to? Go on her, why not? Bro, what is this place? <laughs> this, is the, this is the Halloween side, the scary side. 
I have no idea what we just walked into. Oh yeah, a lot of, a lot of weird things. <laughs> We've seen some stuff already. I've seen some stuff. Actually, I definitely want to check this collector's thing over there. That's cool. They got some right. cool steins looking in there. Steins, all right. Yeah. Oh, that's really cool. Um, I saw it near you at that that place that they have a uh, they have a mounty. I'll have to Ooh, get him. Oh yeah, that's that's like the number one goal. If I see that, I'm getting it. But I don't think he has one here because I saw those, and that's yeah. not a Mountie. Those are the guards from England. In a little town. You never expect to find so many little museums, but we were actually in a decanter museum where decanters are kind of like empty, kind of like bottles that fill like liquor and whatnot. But they're very artsy, very collectible, and I'm in this is amazing. <laughs> Merce in danger. I'll we'll just sign up for a few paychecks. <laughs> Look at that one that holds the bottle and it's a clock. Seagram's benchmark right there. Oh my that god. That is so Guy said he had over warehouses home. full of this stuff. Yeah. Like a couple warehouses. <sighs> Wild. Are you selling this? This is, this is like this is this is the museum stuff, you can sell this stuff. <laughs> well, it doesn't hurt to ask, man. No, no, true, 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 true. Those are your people. <laughs> what a day. Right? I'm sweating, I'm hungry. Murph is contemplating decisions already. Uh, no, it's I'm- been, It's been great. I know, it's a, it's a weird one. I didn't buy anything from here. I was close, but I did not buy anything <sighs> from here. Finally. And you gotta be proud of me for that. As always, we are. And the one that I would have bought something from actually made sense, so. <laughs> That's, well, it kind, kind of made sense. <laughs> Did I need it? No, but it would have been really cool to have. Exactly. Yeah. We're okay. We're, good. We're doing all right. We're good. Uh, as always, guys, if you guys like Sugar Creek, uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you liked it. And see you guys really soon. Say bye, Murph. Bye, Murph. <laughs> okay. <laughs>